What is going on guys? It's your boy Big Dylan and welcome back to another Destiny video. I've just got a really quick vault of glass Atheon challenge guide for you guys. Basically, as it stands, it's very easy to do. It's not hard at all. Basically, what's going to happen in the fight is you're going to split three people up to the left, three people to the right, you're going to stand on the portal in the little ring, and then basically Atheon is going to teleport three people out. Now, basically, Three people that get teleported, you're going to need to call out to your teammates, whether you are in Mars or Venus. Now, where I am stood on screen right now is Venus. On the other side, where I'm looking towards on the other side, is Mars. So that's obviously for the other three people that didn't get teleported, you have to go then build your portal. That's after once you've destroyed your detain shield. Once that's done, you're going to be building the portal. Three people inside, one person will have to put the relic. You're going to actually kill the ad to the bottom the person that has the relic. The other two people that are in there will need to destroy one oracle each. The person with the shield will then have to shoot the third oracle with their actual um, relic. And the other three people will basically have to come in um, that, uh, that didn't get teleported. So you want to, you're going to have to. Like, the first two people that have already destroyed their oracle will have to go back outside. Be careful for supplicants. Or supplicants spawn and they do one shot you if they do open you as soon as you've got the relic and you've all destroyed one oracle each you have to make sure you all destroy one oracle if you don't the challenge is over immediately make sure you all destroy one and obviously it tells you on the death screen if you have to wipe and um, so obviously that's just an indication of what you have to do then you'll have 30 seconds of time of vengeance. So 30 seconds of time of vengeance, you're gonna jump into top mid. The person with the relic is gonna pop up the shield and then you're all gonna damage Atheon. Now the best way to actually get a hell of a lot of damage on him, in my opinion, is Sleeper Stimulant. Sleeper Stimulant deals about 300,000 damage with Tether and Weapons of Light, which is just insane. You can actually one phase him, I think, with that if everyone uses Sleeper Stimulant. So obviously, if you do have that, that would be the best method. Obviously, the weapons light bubble would go on the back platform and top mid. So get your hunter to jump up and tether him. All rip into Atheon with his leg stimulants, and that should be challenging over. Um, if you don't kill him in one phase, two phases should be enough. You can get him down to about half health um, in a phase, which should be done and over with. Um, this was my first um, Vault of Glass hard mode play and challenge mode. So. Hopefully this helps you, you know, try and get the challenge work done. Um, I know it's going up really late, I've just been really busy as of recent. Just like this video, if you enjoyed guys, subscribe to the channel for future content. Thank you so much for watching, and peace.